Coach O, thanks for taking the time. The fall tennis is behind you. Let's talk about that last event. You went down to Nevada, took on a couple of good teams. Your impression of your team? Yeah, it was a great tournament for us. We got to play some really good competition teams that we'll see uh, again in the, in the spring season. So I was really pleased with how we, we performed. We had some really good wins by some guys, and uh, i just highlight a couple of them. Luke Wolf was 2-1 and one in singles. Kyle Garner had a really good, solid win um, as well. Um, Johnny Mascani and Robert Balon beat two very solid players at the top of their lineups. Yeah, and Jordan Azuma, he was undefeated in his singles flight, went 3-0 and to win his bracket. So really good performance by Jordan. So it was a good tournament for us. Um, you know, we came away with some, some really good singles results, but uh, I, we, I felt like we did leave a few matches on the table, uh, especially in doubles. I, I always feel like we should be performing better in doubles, you know, this, this fall season, our, our doubles was not what, it, what we finished up with last year. So I know we've got some work there left to do. Um, unfortunately, Nick Vroman got injured with an ankle injury on the first day. And so he was unable to complete the tournament. And um, um, Urgen Kirsten had a, had a solid win in, in singles as well against a Davis player. So overall, it was a, a pretty good tournament for us. And uh, just a little disappointed our season is ending so early. You know, that's how we schedule it. We got the same number of matches in that we normally do. I just, um, we're, we're finishing really early. So we, we do have a lot of work to do in the off season. Will you be changing lineups in the doubles? Are you trying to look for yeah, different, like, different yeah, combinations? That's, it's a great question. You know, we, we, we didn't win as much as I thought we would win with this, with this, with these combos. Um, so we've got plenty of time, you know, to work on things in the off season. I don't think there's anything wrong with, uh, you know, throwing six new teams out there going into the spring season. You know, I think this off season gives us the opportunity to look at different combinations. You know, when you, when you do play with different players, it allows you to, you know, make sure you're focusing on your skills, you know, the, the basics and doubles. And so I would say we don't have any, any firm teams going into the spring season. No one of, of those three starter teams or four starter teams really performed uh, well enough in my mind to, to hold a spot for sure for the, for the spring season. So I think everything's open on the table for the spring. For sure. So how do you go now? What do you do between now and spring to get better or what do you need to work on? Yeah, you know, that's a great question because I, I think what, what from singles, what I saw that our team lacked a little bit was um, first serve percentage and ability to win free points or get short balls on our first serves. You know, I think of the three teams there, we served, uh, you know, weaker than the other three teams. And so that's definitely something we can work on the off season. You know, we, we do prioritize serving in our practices, but I think we just need to keep emphasizing that. Because I, I think, you know, in college tennis, you know, you gotta be able to make your first serve and hold first serves, um, you know, the majority of the time. And I, I don't think that we uh, were performing at the level I wanted us to this weekend. So that's for sure what we need to work on in singles and, you know, the doubles combinations, we just keep, keep working on the skills that no matter who we put together, we'll make a good team. Yeah. Do you, will you be like toying, tinkering with that, letting them play doubles against each other in different combinations to kind of see what you got? Right. That that's you know we, we do want some chemistry with the teams, and we we certainly don't want to to throw guys out for the first time in the dual match season together. So we have about three months to to, to figure this out, and uh, guys should have a pl plenty of opportunity to play with with new players. Coach O, thanks for the time. Uh, enjoy this training before we get started That's again right. in the spring. Thanks so much, Brian.